home of the 2014 All-Star Game, a look at Target Field in Minneapolis. Today, it's game two of a three-game weekend set between the Detroit Tigers and the Minnesota Twins. And as we draw ever closer to first pitch here this afternoon, let's get a look at today's starting lineup. Had a lot of trouble sustaining any kind of offense, and it definitely hurt him. Brian Dozier will start things out here for Minnesota with Joe Maurer on deck to follow. And this is lifted high in the air down the right field line. And he will make the catch here on the edge of the warning track as he was just able to get back there and put it away for the first down. And this is not an easy play here in right field because he knows that that side ball is approaching fast. But he's able to concentrate. Al Kaline will try it again. 0 for 2 with a fly out and a ground ball thus far. Here's the first offering. Oh, and this is hit high and deep yeah, out to it, left. Find the ball. Into the seats and it's gone. It's a two-run shot to straight away left, and it's now five to three. Well, this is the chance you take when you work up in the zone like this. I mean, this is right in his happy zone, and he jumps all over it and sends it right over the wall. Now a swing and a high fly ball, and this one has some carry on it to deep right field. We'll reach out with one hand to make the catch on the move, and that ends the inning. Swing and he pulls the fastball high in the air toward deep right center. And that's going to do it as the catch is made and the Tigers have claimed the fourth consecutive victory here as this ball game is over. Another good win for these guys and they're playing some confident baseball out there right now. That's their fourth win in a row. So they've got things firing on all cylinders. A tight ball game all throughout. Winds up a slim one-run victory in the end as we get you one final look at our line score. And fellas, as always, a few guys we could have chosen from, but out of everybody, that's the man who stands out in my book. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, he only had one hit, but definitely made it count. A big home run that turned out to be the decisive blow in the ball game. Tuesday Night Baseball from U.S. Cellular Field in Chicago. Tonight, the opener of a three-game series between the Detroit Tigers and the Chicago White Sox. Your 2017 Chicago White Sox. And before we get too much further, here... Al Kaline will stand in for the first. Now the first pitch. Here's a swing and a shot back up the middle. And that's in there. Base hit. Around third and being waved on home. And on the error, a run is going to score. Boy, what a great start to this series here in the first inning. On the road, you'd love to give your pitcher a little something to work with out there. And he's going to have a lead now before he even throws his first pitch. Ray Casilla will get a shot now with two on and two out here in inning number two. Come set, now the pitch. This ball's in the air now out to right field. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning. Al Kaline will stand in, an RBI single in his first appearance. Al Kaline. Hey, come on, we gotta hold him. Here we go, fellas, let's go. Now the first pitch. Hammered the other way to deep right field. And that one's out of here. What another nickel in the merry-go-round. This one is getting ugly.
A two-run blast to straightaway right field. Home run number five on the year. And the Tigers add on. It's now a 5-0 score. Boy, the, the ball is definitely jumping here early. That's the first home run we've seen so far, but it's not the first hard hit ball. And it's looking like it might not be such a good night to be a pitcher. So the base is empty here with one away. And stepping in, the right fielder, Michael Kadire. Now a ball mined to the right side. And that's going to be a base hit for Kadire. Another multi-hit game for him here tonight. No surprise there as we take a look at the league leaders in hitting. And as you see, he's right up there among league leaders in that department. Al Kaline get us started as they look for a little insurance here in the top of the night. Al Kaline. First pitch on the way. Now a ball hit hard towards center. And he'll have himself a base hit. Man, these guys have been aggressive here early in the count. Some people think, oh, you might want to take a pitch to start in that bat. And sometimes that's great, and it works out for a lot of people. But what you should be thinking to have some major consequences. Yeah, anytime you give this guy an at bat, especially with a runner on base that he otherwise wouldn't have had, you're asking for trouble. And that's going to do it as the catch is made and the Tigers make it six straight victories now as this one is over. Well, here we go. Tack another one onto that winning streak. They've now got it up to six in a row. And that's not looking like this hot spell is going to end anytime soon. Very good performance offensively for this bunch, but out of everyone, I think we should single out this fellow right here as our top player of the game. Yeah, I think in the end, this really could have been anybody's award, but what the heck, let's go ahead and give it to this guy. He's just as deserving as anybody. Time for baseball now on a Wednesday night in the windy city of Chicago. Tonight, the second of three to start the week between the Detroit Tigers and the Chicago White Sox. And before we get on with things here, this Al Kaline. See what he can do here with two on and two out here in inning number five. First pitch coming. Good opposite field power here, taken high and deep to right. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will end up, but it definitely helped get this offense going. Leading off for the Tigers. And hard hit towards center. And that'll be a base hit. So very quickly here, the potential tying run is aboard to start the eighth. Up next for the Tigers, left fielder. We've got baseball for you from U.S. Cellular Field on the south side of Chicago. Today, getaway day here in this three-game series between the Detroit Tigers and the Chicago White Sox. Al Kaline will get his first shot at it here. Right fielder. And the pitch. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground towards short. And that's through, a base hit. Al Kaline will dig in now. Conviction in that swing was almost like an afterthought, like an emergency half. Now a ball lying towards center field. That's in there, base hit. And now this is thrown wildly, just getting it into the infield. And he is in to score from... Al Kaline will lead it off here in the top of inning number six. And now pitch on the way. Now a hard hit ball back up the middle. 
And that'll get on through into center field, so he's got himself a leadoff single. Oh, yeah, he's got that magic wand going now. That's his third hit and four trips, all of them singles, and he's been a tough out all game long. Al Kaline will dig in. He singled and later scored his last from the belt. Kicks and deals. He goes the other way as this is hit in the air toward the gap in right center. And this is run down out there in right center as the runner tags from second. Now the relay home in the dirt. And oh, he can't quite dig it out. And the runner is in from second. And that's a good job in that situation. You love a base hit, but hey. The bottom line is you've got to produce it. Just over the river from Windsor, Ontario, we're in downtown Detroit at lovely Comerica Park. Today, it's game two of a three-game weekend set between the Boston Red Sox and the Detroit Tigers. Al Kaline will stand in to lead things off in the bottom of the fifth. Al Kaline. Now the first pitch. Swing and a line drive to center field. And Bradley will play it on the hop. It's a base hit. Maybe these guys are going to start getting a little more aggressive here early in the count. This is first time. Zachary Hendricks will get another. Doesn't have to. If you get that good movement and put it in the right spot, it's plenty good enough to do the job. And that'll get down for a base hit. Nick Cushman. First pitch coming. Hey, now we've got two. Curve ball bounces, and this one gets away. Throw to third. And he is safe at third as he moves up on what's likely to be ruled a wild pitch. He can try to make that perfect pitch. And you know what? If he misses, who cares? Find it, find uh, hold that thought as this ball gets down for a base hit. And he will score as well. And can you believe it? We are tied yet again. I think he was looking for a fastball there. I think he was. That's about it. Al Kaline will stand in. He popped out in his last time. Al Kaline. Yeah, you can do it. No one better. Let's go. Get ahead. Stay ahead. Hey, too late. Here's the first offering. Hey, let's go right here. Now a ball slapped hard the opposite way. And he dives to make a spectacular catch. 